Hi, thank you for watching again. Uh, today, what, we're, what I'm going to be talking about is about making some cool uh, uh, foot pedals. Um, I, w I, was, I went online and I was watching this uh, video. Actually, um, this place where they sell um, foot pedals made out of uh, rat traps. And I thought it was pretty cool. So I started thinking about how am I going to make one of those. So and that was pretty challenging. So I decided to make one uh, just by going, uh, by knowing a little bit of, uh, you know, a little bit of principles on how uh, electrics, electrical wiring works, you know, and uh, what you're supposed to do. So basically, so if you have a little bit of knowledge of that, you'll be able to uh, build something like this. Um, and also what I did on that too, I said, oh, you know, I need to make it cooler. So what I did, I, I just painted a rat right here and a piece of cheese. So it makes it look actually pretty cool. And, um, and on the back, I, uh, you know, usually what I do, I cover this part with, with something uh, rubbery base right here. So it doesn't slip, you know, when I'm using it. So, um, and, but I just left it like that. So because I, I knew I needed to make a video like that. So I can show you how the wiring goes in case you want to build something like that but if you have more questions you can uh, you can contact me and I'll, I'll try to answer those those for you and also get your brass corners you know you can get them from from eBay and uh, those are pretty cool and um, I can probably later on I'll, I'll show you how this thing runs like actually uh, runs out pretty pretty cool you know it has some nice contact you know you can press on it you know, actually, when you buy these things, uh, you know, it, this thing is all the way back here, of course. Right now, it has a lot of tension, so you got to make sure. And it has some other connections right here. And uh, it has like a U, you know, U um, clip right here. And actually, I used the same U clip that it was holding something over here on the trap. And then I just pass it and I, and I use it to hold this part right here. And then one of the wires that is coming from here is exiting a hole right here and I just saw it right here so it has a nice contact and the other one is from here all the way here and then when you press on it of course it's gonna make the contact that's what's gonna make the uh, the machine wrong so um, that's uh, basically what I wanted to show you from this one I have another one that I made um, this one you can actually make it so, uh, pretty cheap you spend like around 20 bucks or something you know between supplies and everything you know the wire, you know, and, and everything, you know, uh, you can actually make them um, spend even less money, depends on where you go. You know, the rat trap is about three bucks or so, plus the wire, that's nothing. Um, these are like three dollars or four dollars a piece, something like five dollars the corners. And then just use your imagination and, and your creativity and, and go for it. And you know, and um, I hope you guys like this. Uh, this cool foot pedal you know it's pretty big but i, I kind of like it like that i guess um so and i'm going to show you another one that i have over here actually the one that i have connected to my power supply uh this one um it's right here this is i made it this one is uh, made out of um a telegraph key again so i decided to carve the base i made this uh russian kind of um I guess it's a logo or whatever you want to call it um, and I put a, a nice um, Russian coin right here so on this actually so like I said you know I mean just use your imagination and um, you can make a lot of cool things you know and just, you know here this one's car this is my my signature logo over here of creation also I just do the same thing with all my machines after I finish them, I kind of put my logo right there in the year that I built it. And uh, I'm going to do the same thing with the rat trap. And uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and, and uh, you know, use your imagination and, and you'll see how many cool things you can create. Alright, thank you.